On Your Mark is a music video. It is directed by Hayao Miyazaki. It was made in 19... The song was released in 1994, but in 1995, uh, Hayao Miyazaki made this film. It is a song by uh, Shage and Asuka, I think. Miyazaki uh, made this music video. Apparently, these two guys had uh, contacted Studio Ghibli about possibly making a music video before this, and apparently they, they were big enough to do that. I'd never really heard of these guys, and I don't actually like this song. But, um, and I'd seen this before once, but I forgot how truly insane this music video is. Because at first, you see images, and you see these guys driving, and there's like this girl with wings flying, and you're like, oh, this is going to be a peaceful music video, ladies flying with wings. You hear the song, you see the beginning of it, this car's driving in a field, you're like, oh, yeah, I, I love Hayao Miyazaki, this is great, it's wonderful. And then you see, uh, you know, some Blade Runner underground city world. And then you see this weird church. And then you see cops break in, you're like, oh, I guess there's something going on in here. And then they just fucking shoot everybody. You're like, wait, what happened to that girl with the wings? And they're just like, like killing motherfuckers left and right. This music video is still being all like, like a, a sweet little ballad. And you're like, what is going on, Hayao Miyazaki? And, and like, everybody's dying all around you. And you're just like, why is this changing? Some, there's sound effects at the same time. What the hell? Obviously, they could not say no to him artistically. So he was just like, yo, I'm just doing this. And first off, the cops kill like everybody it's on your mark because they didn't miss a mark because they killed everybody in this weird future church or whatever but after they literally slaughter everyone not a joke that is what happens they find uh this girl who has wings uh, we presume she's genetically modified or something we're not sure uh miyazaki has actually said this was not to be literal this is probably because he was having writer's block while making princess mononoke and uh, wanted to work on this side project to kind of free him from his writer's block. So he decided he's gonna make some weird shit basically. After these cops kill everybody, these two cops who found the girl with the wings, help get her out and she's taken away to kind of like be experimented on. The cops then free her and uh, basically attack all the scientists who are trying to look at her. And then uh, she is able to be fly, she's able to fly away and then assume that their lives are ruined anyway it, i don't understand all that but the animation is really really good it's sort of strange and weird but uh it seems like miyazaki sort of just had the basics of an idea and just sort of ran with it that's kind of the cool thing about music videos you don't have to fully get into those things because they're super short and that's basically what he does here this was actually released before whisper of the heart um, as a short, so it sounds like they got a lot of exposure out of this. I don't know if it was played on like the MTV in Japan or something like that, but who knows. If you're into Hayao Miyazaki, I actually do recommend this, but this is not really like the movies at all. It just seems like somebody, it sort of reminded me of more of his Nausicaa era or Future Boy Conan, if anything, but it does feel like somebody just kind of like expressing ideas and sort of having fun artistically. It doesn't feel like he had much of a point other than like, when if someone had wings, wouldn't you want to let them free? And I'm like, yeah, sure. Um, I, I don't like this song, which is kind of why I, I've seen this before in the 90s. Someone got me a cool bootleg of it. Um, and the non-linearness of it, like it cuts back to stuff, which is sort of boring. I do think it is a good, overall music video um but i think part of a good music video is you have to like the song which i don't but the animation and miyazaki's direction is so outstanding and very strange it's definitely stranger miyazaki but it is definitely like a um thing that you're like wow that you really went for that in this one it's kind of really strange you know i would like to see in the movies and i if i had seen this when i was like 12 or something uh when this originally came out i think i would have like absolutely loved it um before i like had better taste in music so that sort of ruins it but i like watching this like bizarre exercise that miyazaki did while he's trying to sort of figure out princess mononoke it's sort of you know uh probably one of the weirder jam animation things uh i've seen in a while and it was definitely cool and interesting in a music video way i don't know if it has a broader point so maybe that's why it's not brought up as much but uh it still is cool to watch and maybe it's just cool to sort of work out ideas by an animation great and it's cool for us to sort of watch it.